Hey guys, Riley here. I'm going to show you uh, how badass Mr. Green's little Plenty of Fish ad uploader tool is. If you've already set up a campaign and um, you just want to import the settings and everything, all you got to do is come up here, click Browse, find your little uh, campaign setting that you saved. And this is the same, um, this is the exact uh, campaign I set up that uh, CPM case study with on Plenty of Fish that I uh, blogged about just a couple of days ago. So um, all you gotta do is open the file, click import, and it opens up all the campaign settings you want: uh, campaign name, uh, bid, spin, um, ad copy, tracking URLs, whatever, images, everything you need. There is one thing you need to know about this uh, tool. To get this thing to work correctly, you need to be logged into Plenty of Fish over here. You need to have another tab open with plenty of your uh, Plenty of Fish account that you want to uh, upload these campaigns to. But uh, since I don't want to show you guys this little campaign here, I'm just going to uh, clear everything out. And I'm going to show you how to set up a simple uh, campaign with uh, five different ad copies, 20 images for a total of 100 uh, ads that we're going to set up and I'm going to show you exactly how fast this thing is. I showed everybody at the Oklahoma meetup a while back how fast this thing was and everybody was pretty impressed so let's just start from scratch and um, I'm going to use the same campaign that I set up that case study with so I'm not outing everything I do on Plenty of Fish but here we go. Uh, campaign name is going to be uh, Singles Net, Target Mails 21-24, uh, Maximum Bid, we'll just do the minimum 15 cents, uh, $25 budget since I'm not really gonna make these ads uh, let these ads run but um alright we're gonna target um, people in the US ad target age and this is just something I like to do I don't really care for the between I like to use the equals part so I'm targeting people 21, 22, 23, 24 ad target uh, gender, male um, where we go marital status single and a lot of people don't pay attention but uh you want to make sure and put divorced widowed and separated people in here uh, add that target so right here we got male or people in the US age 21 22 23 24 who are male who are single divorced widowed or separated so uh that's all I'm going to target uh for now the creative names, I'm just going to girls, click through URL, here's where you'd put your uh, tracking URL, but I'm just going to put singlesnet.com, pretend to add sub IDs, and I'm going to do five different ad copies, so I got one, two, three, four, and five, and I'm just going to use some pretty generic um, ad copies here, so let's just do um, single women, um, and this is the same ad copy I use, ad copy I used from the uh, case study uh, from a couple days ago. There are 986 single women that are on line in uh, that variable right there will be replaced by the user's state so it'll look more customized to them and if uh, their state cannot be determined it'll just be replaced by your state uh, okay right here we're just gonna do like I said it's gonna be really generic let's go make these different ad copies I'm just going to customize each one of these little descriptions. Be nice if I could get this little uh, ad copy through. Um, I'm going to do 20 images, like I said, so. To
think that's 20. Um, let's go get these images. And this tool is really uh, straightforward. You can't, uh, no, I forget where I left off. I mean, it's really hard to mess it up. It looks really similar to the uh, interface that uh, Plenty of Fish has. So let's just finish adding these images in here. I keep forgetting where I left off. All right. Okay, now I got all the uh, split testing set up. Um, and to export the campaign, all you need to do is export. And I like to split up the images and campaign. So we'll just set it up as singles net. I don't want to name it that one, but uh, we'll just name it singles net males 2124 because that's all I'm targeting is uh, males who are 2124. Um, save that. And let's see how long this thing takes to uh, set up these hundred different ad copies. And to uh, submit your ads, all you need to do is come down here to the very bottom and um, click Let's Go Fish. Let's see how long this takes. And for any of you who've used Facebook's ad upload tool, you'll know that it's, uh, or at least in my experience, it's pretty damn slow. It's pretty annoying to let a hundred ads upload take you, I don't know, at least an hour. That's how long it would take me back in a day when I was using it. So, I don't know, I've heard it's improved since then, but who knows. Um, 50 seconds, right at 50 seconds, how long that just took. So, man, you can't beat that. And... Like I said, if you ever need to import a campaign, we'll just let's start let's start start over from scratch. Um, need to want to import that campaign we just set up. Oops, um, here's the one I just set up. No, oh, forgot to hit import. Got scared. So see, it sets up everything that I just set up. Maybe it was a um, singles net campaign that accepted 25 to uh, whatever. I don't think that any age limit but 25 let's say we did 25 30 the only thing you need to change is your age targeting uh, I like to do equals like I said 25 26 27 28, 29. and now all you gotta do is click a uh, let's change the campaign I already did so all you gotta do is hit let's go fish again take another 50 seconds let's let it happen and um that's all you gotta do is to uh, set up uh, to scale out your campaign if it's working for you just do 25, 30, 30, 40 however you wanna scale your campaign and track it it doesn't take 50 seconds to do 100 ads so let's let this one finish and we'll do our 200 ads for tonight and uh, call it a night Man, you cannot beat that. I'm telling you guys, it's only a hundred bucks. Money well invested. It'll save you, God knows how much time. So, check it out, guys. You need to get this. If uh, all you gotta do is just click one of the links and purchase this thing from Mr. Green. It's awesome. Peace.